wondering if your hair dryer or straightener will work in Europe? First, you need to check if it is dual voltage. Many are. Check the label and look for input AC 120V to 240V or a variation of that, or a switch that can be set to 125V or 250 volt. If that's there, then you're all set on the voltage end of things. If your hair dryer is 120 volts only, then it will not work in Europe with just an adapter plug. You'll need a proper voltage converter. Watch our voltage guide to determine the correct size voltage converter. However, we highly recommend a dual voltage hair dryer for travel because the high power travel voltage converters for hair dryers do not work very well and are only designed to work for a few minutes. If your straightener or flat iron is 120 volts only, you'll need to look at the power requirement in watts to see if it's less than 150 watts or 200 watts. If that's the case, use it with the Septic's PU151 or PU200 travel voltage converter while in Europe. Note that these converters are not rated for high power items such as hair dryers, which require more than 1600 watts. Now that we've checked the voltage, our next step is to find the right adapter. Different countries in Europe have different styles of outlets. Your hair dryer will most likely have a typical two prong plug format, so you'll need an adapter with at least that type of input. Europe has six different types of outlets, C, E, F, G, J, and L. For these outlet types, the Septic's Ultra Compact Europe Travel Adapter is a great fit. Looking to use your hair dryer in other countries around the world? Watch our handy adapter guide video to find out which you'll need for your next global destination.